YouTube and welcome back to my channel. Tonight I have a very special video for you guys. This is the catch and cook video from our offshore fishing trip in the Florida Keys. Just a week ago, Nick and I were on a fishing charter with Chelsea Charters catching vermilion snapper, yellowtail snapper, yellow-eyed snapper. We caught a big king mackerel, but tonight we are showing you guys how we cook fish tacos with snapper. And I'm so excited to share this recipe with you guys because it tastes so good. So good. And vermilion snapper are probably one of the best tasting fish ever. And I'm not even really a fish person, so if you're not a fish person, you will like this too. So we are going to walk you through the recipe and hang out together and have some fun. First things first, you want to preheat your oven to 425. Second thing you want to do is blend your spices and get that rub on your fish before it goes in the oven. Now it is time to break out the verm. Can you see that? Nick wrote verm on there for vermilion snapper. So as you can see, there's still like a bloodline in each of those that needs to be cut out. So I'm gonna trim that out right now. And then we're gonna coat it with seasoning. So while that fish is cooking away in the oven, you are going to get started on your sauce. So if you don't have a grater to grate your lime zest, you can use a potato peeler. You just peel it off and then finely chop with your knife. Prepared by us, caught by us. It doesn't get better than that. Now we shall eat. <laughs> it's so good. The fish is just so well seasoned, but you still can taste the fact that it's vermilion snapper. This is coming from someone who doesn't even like fish, and I love this. The sauce is amazing, it's tangy, and I mean, can't go wrong with fish tacos. So that is it, YouTube. Thank you guys so much for watching. Nick and I are both hangry now, so we need to put the camera away and eat. But I really love this fish taco recipe. Any white flaky fish will work. It, I just think it's so cool that Nick and I caught these fish ourselves and get to prepare it and eat it. It's, you know, it's the whole process, which is really cool. So that is it. Thank you guys for watching and we'll see you in the next one.